Hi everyone, today we are at King's Indian Fusion Restaurant and we're going to see if their curry are super spicy, okay? So let's go! What would you like to say about your food? Yes, this is miso. Yeah, uh, miso? Miso, like uh, misal, yeah. Okay. It's, uh, the beauty about this dish is it's made up of uh, different, different, 17 different spices that you normally don't find in curry. It's basically a very native and regional dish come from Maharashtra and you can have it as a breakfast, yes. Breakfast? Lunch, yes, okay. breakfast. Uh, lunch or dinner and it has a feeling of putting the whole body on fire because of oh, the oh, oh, element body. Wow, yes, that's new. Uh, that elements are used in it and uh, you don't taste chili there is not much chili in it there is more spices in it okay however you can increase the chili according to your likeliness but what we have done here is our attempt to serve you around 8 to 8.5 out of 10 spicy dish eight to 8.5. Heard that? 8.8.5. So yeah. you come to this and restaurant and you want super spicy, he give you 8 to 8.5. You ask for that. Yeah. Yes? Generally we serve it around 7.5. This is our standard but for you, uh, as you have indicated that your tolerance is quite high. So we yes. try to make it to your tolerance. By adding chilies, we don't kill the flavor. So we don't want to do around 9 or 10 out of 10 kind of spice because it's just chili you better eat it from the plant rather than at my restaurant <laughs> okay so uh, that's what we try to do that uh, we give you the feel of chili not the taste of chili right on. so you may try it okay so let's eat let's take a look at the dish and let's see how it goes there is fresh sprout oh sprout okay yeah a bit of potato boiled potato what else and, and a crispy mixture on top which makes it uh, makes the mouth salivating and oh. the special blend of spice which you can see it makes the whole curry dark browner yep there is no sugar there is no cream there is no yogurt there is no any other milk product it is naturally vegan cool so what chili would you say this is Contains? Or what, what chili variety do I have on my spoon here? You have too many varieties because you are uh, tolerant but what, what without, spoon? without making it to your requirement it has Kolapuri red chili extra hot uh, uh, red chili, black pepper and some other spices which I do not want to Wow, remember. okay. So let's see how it goes. Normally add lime on okay. it, yep. but we have lemon with us. Okay. Oh. So squeeze the generous amount of lemon on it. So squeeze lemon as the point says. As much as possible. Much as possible. Okay. Okay, so I put two yep. lemon with Mix it. it well and mix it well. Okay. Right. Properly. May I do the one? Yes, please. Because it oh. has a bit of runny. Sorry, I'll just keep that. Runny texture. Mm -hmm. So you have to mix it quite well. Okay. Now, let's take it here. Now either originally okay. you have to eat it with either bread. Eat it with bread, yes. You can originally like regional way, yep. Indian way yep. Yep. is to eat it with either bread. Yep. Or you may go with this garlic now. Mm, I love it. I love the veggie and the beans Crunch. and, and oh, it's, it's very nice this challenge I need to finish the dish with no water and no um, no water after eating it for about five to ten minutes so I also have a timer to tell you how how long I take to eat it so let's start are you sure? yeah I'm very sure mmm Enjoy it. Oh, it's fantastic. Really fantastic. You've got to come here and try this dish. Ma'am, 
the first. Wow. So far among the three challenges, this is wow, full of flavor. Mm -hmm. Not spicy still. Mmm. Mm. Man, I feel the chili starting to heat up at the back of my tongue. Well, not the front part, but the back part. Wow. <laughs> the burn is not in the front, really at the back. One minute, 45. <clears throat> Still good. Still very good. Second bread. <clears throat> mm? So we use a small spoon so you get more taste because the bun says, you know, you slowly chew it, you get more taste. Um, <clears throat> half the pot. See, almost done. More, more than, more, I think more than half the pot. Oh. Still surviving. This is where it gets. Ouch. It's a good ouch. I feel... I feel it here now. I'm still not done with the dish. <clears throat> feel it here now. And I feel the spices. I feel the heat. <clears throat> the heat is I don't know from which chili. But yeah. It's burning. It's a good burn. I feel the head going. The heat. <clears throat> Time. Four minutes. It's very good, very good with the bread. Oh, look at this. <clears throat> and I need to mop out everything, so... Empty... This? Mm. Clean! Clean! <clears throat> the last little bit. Fantastic, fantastic dish. Haven't died from it yet. No, I'm still very much alive. The bun is there. The bun is really there. No, still very much alive. <clears throat> So I've got to mop the plate up, okay, so I'm going to use another piece of bread to mop it up. Uh oh, I forgot. Oh, the fun says I'm supposed to have this during the meal, so I have to eat this? Okay. Not with bread! Not with bread! Okay, let's see. It's already burning. Now this is real challenge. No. No. <coughs> I thought it'd be horror. It's quite nice. It's like okra. It's like oh, I feel it. I feel it, but it's not like boom, I kind of feel it, but yeah, it's like the back of it, the back of here, you know, this part here, wow, <clears throat> this part, this whole back end of the tongue, it's like, you know, if your, if your tongue was, you know, this is your tongue, right, it's like this half of the tongue at the back, the tip of the tongue is fine, this part is fine, this back end, and come,
Now that's something. Eight minutes. No water. Damn. That's why she. I still got. I still got the mod to play out. Ow. The first out of the of among the challenges is this one. Ow. Mop it up. Mop it up. Mop it up. <laughs> burning but <coughs> this part is burning. This part is warm. More pop coming. This is what I call a real chili challenge. So plate is clean. Mop the bowl. <coughs> Must be shiny. Everything has to go. Everything has to go. See, shiny. Shiny bowl. Oh. Clean! Clean! Now, this is the, this is the gnarly part. <coughs> the nose really gets you running. So, oh! 11 minutes and 30 seconds. Yep, 11 minutes and 30 seconds. A very very fine meal, very very tasty, also a vegetarian dish, best so far out of what I've done, um, really really spicy, mm, not dead yet, <laughs> give me 5 minutes, okay we will come back after 5 minutes, 7 minutes to, you know, when I think it's about seven minutes since I last finished the dish. I must say that uh, I haven't had water. It is burning. It's like the, 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 the tip of, you know, the, the, the tip of your tongue or my tongue here. Maybe your tongue is like this again. You know, this part is, is, is having a frostbite. That's the numbing effect. Oh, that numbing effect is fantastic. And um, it's flavorful. I actually now don't feel the burn anymore, it's, it's, it's not there, the, the residual effect. Um, Chef Tapan said that you get a whole body, kind of whole body burn. Um, no, it's, it's, it's warm, very good for winter, you know. So this winter guys in Brisbane, come and try this place. It, it, it's really good for those cold nights. My ratings for this dish is 8 chilies out of 10. So very good, very fantastic. One of the spiciest so far among all the dishes that I've tried. So um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, Brisbane, chefs in Brisbane, our friends in Brisbane. If you know of any other restaurant or cafe with super spicy food, you know please comment below. And um, yeah, I will go and try it and film it. So um, thank you very much. See you soon. Ciao.